YouTube, YouTube, you to the tube. It's your boy OG, and you see what I got on deck. We're not gonna waste any time, man. You saw my Instagram shot of these. It's gonna be the mellow 13s, man. The mellow 13s. They definitely escaped me, man. I was trying to catch up with these for the last maybe month or so. And they had them at an outlet, but I wasn't in position to grab them. So, the past weekend, I had to go ahead and act fast because I know they got another stock in. And I had to make that drive. It wasn't an easy drive. But I had to go ahead and make it. The Mellow 13s, the B-grade joints. And um, I must say... I am very satisfied with them. They, you know, 159, 160 at the outlet. Um, I did win these on finish line, but of course, you know the story. They took them back, and of course, we did not have a chance to purchase this particular release. But you've seen reviews on them. Not gonna go into details, but I want to just take a look at the quality on them. As you can see, that this little thread here sticking out, I can cut that probably with a little razor blade or something like that. But as you can see, the yellow and around that edge, you can see some of that bleeding, that red bleeding on them. Um, I did have to go up a size. Um, the nine and a half just had red stains on them like they may have like you drop kool-aid on them or something you know what i'm saying so couldn't find a, a decent pair on the nine and a half so i had to size up on the 10 um, right there got a little glue stain you know but um most of all you know i dig the pair so i had to have them toe box area looked to be okay tongue looked to be okay red jump man Looking at the inner portion of the shoe, get a little closer as you can see that red bleeding through on that um, from that where the sole and the shoe meets. But they put it, you know, right in this area here. As you can see that red bleeding through. But like I said, on the nine and a half, they had red dots in this area also. But um, eventually, the shoe probably gonna bleed through. You know, hopefully, no time soon. You can take a look at the back side. Also, you got some of that red bleeding. Um, like I say, the insole got that mellow, uh, his signature and his uh, name mellow on the uh, footbed of the shoe. It would have been dope if they would have had that mellow on the tongue. Definitely would have been digging that. Let's take a look at the other shoe, which will be the left shoe. And we're looking at it up close. Some glue stains around there. Not much red. Well, yeah, you see a spot right there, that red spot. Also some red bleeding around that midsole area. Um, like I say, they definitely are B grades. So once you get them in hand, you start um, seeing the reason why Nike Jordan brand did pull them off the shelves. Bleeding on this side also, that red paint. But um, hey, B grade, got it from the outlet. Like I say, I'm definitely digging the shoe. Definitely wanted these. Finish line, I want a raffle. I think it might have been the last raffle I won off finish line, but for the last pass, maybe what, four or five releases. But um, hey, I'm glad I got these here. Like I said, I had to drive about an hour and a half. It's normally a two hour drive up to that outlet. It's not the outlet I normally go to. Uh, had to drive about two hours and I just made it before they closed. The uh, employee did let me in before she locked the door and I didn't have a lot of time to grab pairs. Like I said, it was they was ready to go home. You know, they was being nice, but also letting you know, hey, it's time to go. You know, so I had to look through a couple of pairs right fast and I grabbed one on the back out the door. I did see some 
guys pulling up, running to the outlet, but it was too late. They had already closed the doors. Um, the outlet is in Commerce, Georgia. Like I say, it's going to be almost on a normal day. It'll be a two hour drive because of the traffic. Like I said, I had to go at night and trying to make that drive. It wasn't, it was traffic, but it wasn't a lot of traffic. You know what I'm saying? If, if that makes sense, it was more of a weekend um, trip, weekend traffic. But hey man, I was able to get in and get out thanks to the Nike employees not locking the door on me. But hey, it was worth the trip, man. Got these Mellow 13s in hand. Let me know what you think about it. Let me know if you picked them up. Let me know if you're still on the hunt for them. Like I said, if they do come to my outlet, I'll definitely put up a video, let y'all know. Like I said, that outlet is closer to me and I might be able to help some people out that want a pair, that, um, that definitely want a pair. I might be able to help you out on that part of getting a pair. But like I said, this outlet was so far out, I barely made it. Only really had time to run in and run out and pick these up. Family, I appreciate y'all for pressing that play button. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Give your boys a thumbs up. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I drop a vid. And I'm out. Peace.